The first game of the second day at the 2011 Doc Larson Round Ball Classic featured the Golden Demons of Golden, Colorado and the Chugiak Mustangs. After opening round losses to Carver and Wasilla, the Chugiak Mustangs and the Golden Demons would battle back and forth in a display of contrasting styles. The Mustangs would work the offensive glass in the paint, while the Demons would live and die by the long ball. Demon leaders Jordan Johnson and Brad Chacho illustrate with a pair of threes from the opposite ends of town. As they would several times on the afternoon, the Mustangs take advantage of an overcommitted press. Peyton Fulmer makes the long pass to Wade Snell, who finishes. But Nate Hill pushes the ball up the floor quickly to get it in the hands of Jordan Johnson, who hit five of the 13 missiles he launched in the second half alone. We're all knotted up at 41, but Jordan Johnson does his thing, tickling the ionosphere and then the strings. But Johnson would show off other skills, as here he draws the D with penetration and slides the baseline dime to teammate Gage Parker for two. Then Wade Snell initiates the two-pass attack, getting it up to Matt Oldenkamp, who delivers to Luke Plum underneath. Plum would need two tries, but finishes with a deuce. When you're feeling it, you're feeling it, as Jordan Johnson launches another three ball from his backyard in Golden, and the Demons are on a run. The Demons then used a little slip screen from Johnson to open a hole in the Mustang zone to get Brad Chacho a turnaround look from six feet. Chacho led the Demons with 21 points. Tyler Olson gets in on a good thing, and the Demons score 29 third quarter points to take a 10 point lead. A well executed inbounds play turns quick perimeter rotation and a solid low post screen from Jordan Johnson into two more for Brad Chacho. The Mustangs turn 17 offensive rebounds into 13 second chance points. Game high scorer Steven Puderbaugh takes advantage of a freebie to break the ice for Chugiak. The Mustang miss on their next possession leads to some sharp demon passing in transition. Brad Chacho makes the extra pass, but Gage Parker doesn't get the roll. Parker misses on the free throw, but Tyler Olsen anticipates the outlet pass and bounces the dime to Leonard Holland. Timeout, Chugiak. The Demons outscored the Mustangs 22-5 in eight game minutes. The message must have been clear in timeout because the Mustangs get back to basics. Feed the big fella. Game high scorer Steven Kuderbaugh posted 26 points, six of them in this minute and a half stretch. Three different wings drop meat in the cage. First Wade Snell, then Peyton Fulmer. And finally, Skyler Fulmer. Golden Demon head coach John Anderson has seen enough. Timeout Golden. The Demon lead is down to eight. But the Mustangs aren't done. Skyler Fulmer makes the tough catch in transition and gets it to Chugiak's other inside threat, Marquis Spearman. The Golden lead is down to six with just under four minutes to play. Steven Puderbaugh grabs a rebound on a Demon miss and outlets it Jayhawk style to Peyton Fulmer on the release. Fulmer finishes, and it's a four-point ball game. Peyton returns the favor, setting Puderbaugh up for two more. Big possession for the Mustangs, chance to tie. They swing it around the perimeter, and Skyler Fulmer gets it to Marquis Spearman at the elbow. One dribble turnaround, and we're all knotted up at 60. 14 unanswered points for the Mustangs. Steven Puderbaugh has a chance to make it a two-point ball game, and he converts on both. But Austin Rickard is given a chance to earn the points back at the other end, and he does. A great way to start a four-game day at Doc Larson's 2011 Round Ball Classic. We've got a fantastic finish in the balance. Out of timeout, the Mustangs dissect the press. For an easy deuce from Steven Puderbaugh, Marquis Spearman with the generosity. The Demons would miss on their first try at the other end, but use a second chance to sink the dagger. Jordan Johnson's fifth three ball of the half with 38 seconds on the clock. Down one, the Mustangs launch their own three ball, getting Peyton Fulmer the open look, but from NBA range, the Demons track down the rebound, and an alert Jordan Johnson calls timeout. The Mustangs put Demon lead scorer Brad Chacho on the stripe to shoot one and one with 6.5 seconds to play. The second one is no good. One last chance for the Mustangs. Jordan Johnson pressures the shot and avoids the foul, and the Golden Demons come away with a two-point win. The Demons would go on to play the Palmer Moose on the last day of the tournament, 
Jugiak Mustang Stephen Puderbal led all scorers with 26 points and added 12 rebounds. Marquis Spearman contributed 14 points, 9 rebounds, and 3 steals, 6 for 9 from the floor. Skylar Fulmer posted 12 points, 6 rebounds, and 3 steals. The Golden Demons were led by their dynamic duo of Jordan Johnson and Brad Chacho. Chacho had 21 points, 9 rebounds, and 6 assists. Johnson hit 5 second half threes on the way to 19 points, 6 assists, and 3 steals. Final score, Golden Demons 66, Mustangs 44. Next year's Classic is the 27th, 28th, and 29th. Thanks a ton, Doc Larson, for your never-ending support of Alaskan athletes.